All right, what is up guys? Professor Akali here bringing you a new video on the 65% win rate Akali build. Guys, this is the current highest win rate build on Akali and it makes no sense. All right guys, I just wanted to let you guys know about a few huge giveaways myself and a few other YouTubers are doing. All you have to do to enter is like the video, comment down below, and enter in the description. We are going for the Conqueror Domination AP One Shot Madness. I honestly don't understand because, you know, Conqueror... Usually something you'd see a top lane bruiser tanky, uh, taking or, uh, you know, just like, I guess, a tanky champion. But today we're going for the specific build that is just showing to be the best on OPGG. 65% win rate. It's Conquer with the AP one-shot build that you go Gunblade, Lich Bane, Zonias. It's complete weird nonsense. I don't understand exactly why it's so good, but apparently it is. So yeah, we're going to be doing a video on this. So I hope you guys do enjoy. And without further ado, let's get right into this. Um... Oh no, oh no, missed that barely. And, okay, okay. All right, so I think I might just AFK, no. But seriously though, um, so yeah, we're going to be doing a full game commentary. Um, this is going to be maybe the most, well, talking about interesting things going on. It's been definitely one of the most interesting things um, I've seen on Akali. I do think Conquer is an amazing keystone to be completely honest with you guys. I, I feel like Conquer is really, really good. Oh no, I missed the cannon. Oh shoot, I'm coming, I'm coming. But the fact that you build it on an AP one-shot build is very strange to me. Yo, yo, we can definitely win this fight. We win this easy. This is the easiest win ever. Oh my god. Oh, double buffs and double kill and first blood gold. We're so fed right now, holy shit. Hell yeah, dude. Oh my, yes. Okay, okay. Wow, <laughs> that's great. That's freaking... Holy crap! All right, all right. let's 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 uh, let's calm it down. Let's calm it down. Holy shit! Uh, anyways, so yeah, guys, this is going to be the most interesting uh, Kali build I've pretty much ever done uh, in terms of like ones that work in ranked. Obviously, you know, there's a lot of troll builds, but the fact that this has a 65% win rate is absurd. And I'm gonna link you guys uh, all the runes if you want to copy it. I'll leave like a screenshot, or I'll just list out all the runes in the description, and also link you guys the OPGG link that uh, shows that this has the win rate. I'm not just I'm not just exaggerating. It actually has a 65% win rate. Um, so yeah, the one of the best parts, obviously, other than the conquer, um, you know, that's a little bit difficult. But yeah, the best thing in my opinion about this keystone or about this build is the uh, just the attack speed and the obviously the true damage. But the thing is with this build, it's very interesting because conquer is so difficult to make work uh, on a AP one shot champion that's so squishy because. You know, usually it's it's pretty hard to get Conqueror to start working in the middle of a team fight, especially when you have like a one shot build. You normally with a one shot build, you want to just jump in and one shot and then run away because you know if you jump in and don't run away right after you jump in, you, you're gonna die because you're squishy. Anyways, let's go on with this. We got Conqueror. Like, we got Conqueror working for us. This guy doesn't have flash. This guy's just so dead. You want to die too? Like, do you actually want to die? That's right, dude. Literally, like, I already used everything, and just Q auto, and he's down to, like, beyond less than half health. Wow. Uh, so, Conquer... Oh, let's mention this. Let's mention this. Um, in case you guys didn't see my last Conquer video, um, Conquer definitely stronger than Electrocute and mid and late game. It's just... It's undeniable. It does way more DPS in the long run. Holding the shit. Oh, this guy's dead. Well, this guy's so dead. What? Back here. Yes! Yes! There we go. Barely got in range there. Holy crap. And if he was not level 4, and I wasn't fed off of that first double kill, would not have had the damage to snipe him with my Q there. Uh, but yeah, Conquer is much better than Electrocute mid and late game. It uh, it just overall... It's just... Like, especially against tanks, but like... I mean, I guess it, the priority... Like, the main thing about this... Is, oh, no, oh, no, oh, no, oh, no, 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 no. Holy crap, I did not mean to auto attack him and almost die there, but he has no flash, so he's not gonna kill me, right? Yeah. Alright, we're going back. Uh so yeah, I'm trying trying to keep a train of thought here, but uh honestly guys, I'm not gonna lie, I don't exactly understand why Conquer plus this equals OP. Like legitimately I'm just gonna be honest with you guys. Uh, it seems like Conquer is only good on bruisers. People that are tanky that can like, you know, make use of it, keep auto attacking, keep refreshing it. But there's got to be something about it, right? Um, maybe it's the fact that Akali has her shroud, and in that sense she becomes tanky because she becomes 
more she has more survivability uh we'll tap to see i have not done this build yet the conquer one shot build as far as i can remember and i think i can remember every build i've done so yeah we're going to be just i guess experimenting in this video going to be going for the gunblade first item i think i already mentioned that second item lich bane third item zonias and that's like pretty much how you always build it um sword boots are the build of or the boots of choice with this ap one shot build and i'm actually gonna go bot right now all right, this is looking pretty free, pretty beautiful. Oh man, oh man. Wait. If you don't flash, you're dead. I mean, if you flash, you're still dead. Ooh, damn. I wonder how much true, man, true, dam yeah, true damage I did off of just one Q auto. All right, let's, uh, let's go back to mid now. This is a definitely, definitely a pretty good start to the game considering we have every single kill on our team. All right, um... I'm not going to be missing a cannon minion. They're worth like 10,000 gold now after the changes, so. Yeah. Yeah, okay. I don't care. I got the cannon. Yeah, yeah, it doesn't even matter. I got the cannon. Yeah, you know, it, we don't even need any CS. We just got the cannon, so it's like everything. Okay. And now I'm going top lane. Infernal, yes, please take that. Definitely a nice dragon to have on your team's ahead. Nice little lucky spawn. And there we go. There's Diana. How are you doing, Diana? Yeah, you're dead. I think this guy's dead too. Let me use a potion here. Be patient. Okay, that was a lot closer than I thought it'd be. That was, that was a lot closer than I thought it'd be. Alright, the only person on their team that's a problem is this game's Yasuo. That might be a problem. And honestly, it's okay. Whoa, that was a very fast Q proc. Anyways. Gunblade. Eight minutes. We also have enough gold for boots too. We are stupidly fed right now. Uh, there's no denying it. I think this is working out pretty well. Maybe, maybe there's some hidden lane power to this that I didn't realize. But honestly, I'm gonna just go with the fact. I'm just guessing that we got so fed off with that double kill and snowballed it. I don't think it has anything to do with the runes. But you know, maybe. Anyways, it looks like we need to kill the Yasuo, and then we are completely stacked on bounties. Uh, you know, the little what is it, Ravenous Hunter? Plus we have Alacrity. To just give us attack speed and uh, spell vamp for every single kill. It's permanent too, so we definitely want to kill Yasuo. ASAP. And it looks like Diana's just giving up, dude. She's going to make Yasuo deal with me, and that's, a, that's great for me, because in case you guys didn't already know this, we pretty much counter Yasuo. Alright. Yeah, let me just show you why your little 3-0 nonsense means nothing. Hold me, dude. Sorry, I dare you. I dare you. And Conqueror's ready. Good night. No way. Oh my god. Oh my god. I actually... I cannot believe how bad that was. Ah, oh, shit. Oh, he didn't kill me! He didn't have enough damage! How does he not have enough damage? Wow, Kane's ult's worthless! Holy crap, dude. I was spam A-clicking just in case he didn't actually have enough damage. Ooh, hoo, hoo. Oh my god. Alright, alright. That's good. That's some good stuff right there. Alright, and... Let's continue. Alright guys, and now we are back into this. This Yasuo has no chance. He is completely done for. Wait a second. He has no, he has no knockup. Conqueror is up in a second. Wow, I can't believe I did that. I actually can't believe it. That was maybe the dumbest thing I've ever done. Alright, well, after that int, I mean, I guess we just get to take the free turret because he is now back. Actually, he died. He died to Warwick. Alright, please, give me this. Give me this. No way. Alright, dude. I think Conqueror's on him. Yeah. Yeah, I feel like E Gunblade. Alright, almost. Anyways, that's a free kill. I think he just tried to make a desperation play to save his turret, but did not work out. Actually, wait, we already lost the... F oh, we didn't get the first turret of the game because it was top lane, damn it. Alright, um... I think I'm going to dive this Diana. I want to get my Conqueror up first, unless she jumps on me. One, two, three, and we're good. Oh, nice, I did not get creep block. 
Honestly, 2018 League of Legends, I expected completely to get League Block, uh, League Block, Creep Blocked. Anyways, let's continue. Um, I still need to kill Yasuo. Oh, no, I killed Yasuo. Hell yeah, dude. Alright, so, it's GG. <laughs> we have all five Bounty Hunter stacks, and I gotta be careful here. I can definitely kill him. Definitely kill him. Nice. I just be a little patient, get rid of his bone plate, and get rid of everything else. Want a mess? All right, I'm gonna. I gotta run. I gotta run. Oh my god! No, no, the E. No, damn it! Ooh, E reveals me, so I had to just like make a desperation play. All right, thirteen and two. That's not good. And that's not good either. Okay, well, a little bit of throwing going on. A little bit, just just a tiny bit. I think. I really want to sell this Dark Seal. Like, I, I just, I want to get it. Oh my god, is that the second Infernal Drake, too? Alright, this is, like, actually the most beautiful thing ever. Alright, get it. Um, do we sell the Dark Seal? Oh, it's not a third Infernal. It, it can still be. We just have to go and, you know, pick up some stuff. Wait, hold on. We have to just take this in ocean as fast as possible. Alright, yeah, we're selling the Dark Seal. I know it had stacks. Maybe that wasn't the best idea. It could have just farmed up, like, Wraiths or something, or Raptors, whatever it's called now came back but honestly that's not how we roll we got to just get the items the OP big damage items all right and now we continue hold on okay I think we're gonna go top lane now looks like this Yasuo is definitely overextended as long as he doesn't kill my Aurelia and then disappear into the darkness I got this guy. Well, let's see what happens. I, I think I, I think I got him. Yeah, I got him. There's no way he gets me, or he gets away. Holy damage! Ha, just kidding. You can't beat, beat Nikali's burst. Get out of here. All right. Um. Yeah, we gotta be careful with this Yasuo though. Holy DPS, man. All right, we're 14 and two though, so we really shouldn't have any problems with anyone. Just if they're together, uh, then we should definitely be careful. But anyways. I think moving forward, we have two items. We don't have the Zonias yet, so it's even more important now that we have like our Conqueror ready before we jump into like a 1v5. So like maybe just start attacking like a minions or a turret or a jungle or something before we really go like two balls deep if we know that other people are there. Like Earth's about, we're about to be outnumbered. But yeah, I'm, uh, the question is, do I group this game or do I split push? I think I'm gonna take blue buff, damn it. I want blue buff so bad. I probably could pick up a kill here. Alright. Yeah, this is a free kill. This has to be a free kill. And she runs away from me. Okay. Nice. Oh, shit. Goodbye. Yeah, get away from me. <laughs> Please get away from me. Hold on. Shroud's up in a second. No knock up. Goodbye. Nice. Got the passive ready off the minion. Off the jungle camp, rather. And we're going in. Uh, do I use my shroud blink over the wall? I don't think so. I need it. I need it to be uh, able to fight them. Be careful. We gotta run away. I just need to. Like, when my shroud is down, you guys gotta understand that's all of Akali's. Like, that's everything for Akali. It's not her dashes and whatnot. It's the shroud, like, cause you you try to one v one someone without a shroud, like you have your Q auto and then you eat them and then you have nothing. You're just another worthless uh, mage that has no cooldowns up. Like gunblade autos don't count. It's not good enough. All right. Definitely not justifiable to try and one v one Yasuo with no sums. Shit, 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 shit. Just be careful. Just be careful. All right. Um, I feel like we should just go for a Zonia's right here. Yeah, we have it. Let's go back. We have an 18-minute spike. This is ridiculous. We are so fed right now. Okay. Yep, let's do this. All right. Way earlier than I thought we'd get it, but this is the build. This is the build. You go... Well, actually, I'll show you the order, too. So you go Gunblade, Lich Bane, Zonias, and then, uh, you know, Sork Boots, wherever you want it to be. Because I, I usually get Boots earlier. Some people like to get it, like, 
third. I don't know. It's up to you. I just think the movement speed is really good. Plus, you know, magic pen is always nice. Anyways, let's kill this guy. He's about to have his knockout. Use it. Oh, use it. Use it. Use it. Good luck. Goodbye. Goodbye. <laughs> Goodbye, sir. Thank you for using your knockout. All right. And that's one thing he is going to regret. Five and five. So much for being fed, man. Ooh, use the Z. What are they doing? They're using all their cooldowns. Conquer's up. God. Damn, that was fast. Q-Proc too. Alright, and we aced them. We aced them. Okay, this is, uh... This is pretty good. They don't even have tanks to, like, fully make use of the fact that you just melt right through tanks because, you know, their MR, their armor, means nothing to Conquer. It means actually nothing, because when you have this much damage, and it's being converted into true damage, it's just, yeah, it's just, it just means nothing. Okay, now we're going to push this, and... That was a huge mistake. Conquer is working for us. Holy shit, that burst! No! Dude, that was an easy... If I had one Q auto... Maybe maybe I could have dodged a single Ezreal Q throughout that or something, but Q auto would have healed me so much between our passive being ready plus the fact that we have how much? 15% spell vamp on top of our Gunblade spell vamp. That's third. Holy crap, dude. Yeah, we would have definitely pented right there, but I mean, too bad. <laughs> what can you do? Anyways, so now we've gotten the full item build. I guess it's preference at this point, but um, generally when you have a huge lead like this, there's two ways of playing it. With Conquer, it makes me want to go tanky, but if I had Electrocute, I'd probably go Morello's here, just because it's such good stats. Now you like, forget the healing reduction thing. Um, so I'm going to go for Riley's here, and then I'll probably go for a, a Lyandry's, because it does give you health, it gives you all that stuff. So yeah, let's go back into this now. Let's get this con let's get this as fast as possible too, because I want to see if we can get a triple Inferno. It's always like really fun just to have 24% bonus AP. Jeez. Okay, yeah, get that, get that. You know, I'll help, because I, I, I think I can probably do a good amount of damage to it. Alright. Anytime now. Cool. Alright, gotta be careful. Shroud's down, I want to get... I want to just jump over this wall, because it would save me a lot of time, but... Now I have to be careful for a few seconds, until it comes back up. I don't want to jump in on this yet. Need to be careful. Okay. Holy conquer. I need to see, like, I need to start paying attention to how much true damage we're doing. I know it's, like, definitely in the hundreds, like, several hundred true damage. Because it's 30% of the damage we do. And, you know, based off of our stats, like, our Q should be doing just immense amounts of damage. Yep, yep, you know you're doing a lot of damage when Yasuo with Bone Plating gets one shot. Yep, talk about the damages. Okay, let's continue. I'm gonna one shot this guy too with the flash. And he's dead. <laughs> and he's dead. We're on a rampage. Okay, this is uh this is definitely a stomp. Would have been a little bit better had they had some tanky champions, but I mean they're getting a little tanky, but not like resistance wise. They're getting a bunch of health. But I guess maybe they know there's no point because we do have conquer. Alright. Why am I tanking this? Alright, let's, let's back up, let's back up, let's back up. I wanna get Baron and actually do one more one more play. Infernal's coming up too. Okay, um Lyandries in one thousand gold. We can be max build in like twenty four minutes. Let's take this. Don't you dare cue that. Okay. We got it. I wanna go in for one V five. Conquer gives me, give me strength. Conquer, let's do this. And it. Please, why am I running this way, dude? I don't think I could have played that worse. I really don't. I feel like it, to play that worse, I would have had to actually have blindfolded myself. Damn. <laughs> Shit, that was, that was pretty terrible. 
Ooh, Winions. Okay, cool. Well, all right. Like I guess everyone. I mean, we. I think we deserve. Uh, we deserve one do over, or I guess the fourth one. But still, uh, I think it's okay. But yeah, that was that's pretty bad. Could have definitely like done so many Q autos and just ran into Shroud again. Or a lot of things I could have done differently there. Like just because when you run in and out of your Shroud, uh, it instantly puts you back into in invisibility. So a quick Q auto to heal up, run in and out of Shroud within like half a second. Could have made a lot of work, and maybe, maybe, but probably not. Could have one v five them. I was definitely a little too caught out to say I can one v five them. Anyways, sixteen hundred gold, so nine hundred gold until the final item. Three minutes on this. I think we can probably just end the game before that. Okay, and let's get this. Okay, just gonna take double buffs. I guess at this point. The enemy team is just like practice for us, like micro practice. Just trying to see if we can 1v5 them. And, uh, you know, just between having to dodge out every single thing they have, the, the Lulu E, we gotta stay away from that. The Yasuo Qs. I guess Kane's W, but Kane's W is just. I don't know why. I've, I've, it's such a slow cast, but I have trouble dodging it. Alright. Let the fun times begin. Ooh, 1v5 Penta? No, 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 no. Oh my god. Whoa! Why couldn't the red buff just dig faster? That would have penta -ed. Oh my god. Dude. Wow, wow, wow. <laughs> okay, and you know what? Actually, about this build, I just realized something else. The cool thing about when you go conquer and it takes time to tick up, is your Lyandries works around the same time that Conqueror comes up. Like, you get that... So you see how it does, deals 2% more damage for each second in combat? Around the time Conqueror is ready, you get that maximum 10% bonus damage. So you get that on top of the true damage. Ooh. I see it. I, I can see the, the math behind this. The 200 IQ formula of Conqueror plus Lyandries equals OP. Anyways, um... Let's get this. Yeah, we are completely max build now. It is time to end this game once and for all. Maybe that last zone wasn't good either. I don't know. It's too late to care about that. Let's go back into this. Yeah, let's end it. Let's end it. And... And... Nice. We're finally going to win this game. 30 kills, 26 minutes. Wait a second. Never mind then. This Yasuo is just so strong. I would say he's OP, but to be honest, like I can't really say that when I'm playing a colleague. Okay, gun blade him the second I can. Oh, <laughs> oh dude, you messed up. Come on, burn dead. Conquer still up. Yeah, get out of here. All right. Let's see how much damage we do with this. Lich Bane, <laughs> almost a thousand damage. Wait, come on, let's hurry up. And, yep, yeah, okay, 1200 damage. Conqueror's ready. Pretty sure that was 231 damage, true damage. Pretty sure that's what I just saw. Holy shit. I actually need to see how much true damage I do. Uh, wow, okay, I think let's end it. I don't, th I don't th I think they're done. They're done with this game. Well, alright guys, <laughs> let's do the outro. GG well played. Hold on, hold on. No, maybe not. Maybe we just kill them all. Alright. Alright, guys. There we go. GG well played. Conquer, AP one shot, Akali. 65% win rate. I guess I see how. <laughs> if you guys enjoyed this video, please be sure to leave a like and subscribe if you're new. It really helps me out a lot. And I'm out. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you all in a new video. Peace.